Cheers. Mm. Mm. I'm going to give this a three. Three and a half. Uh, hi YouTube, welcome, this is a beer review, I'm Clint. And I'm Luke. If you don't know, by now, you should. I drink a beer. I drink a beer. And that's about it. We like beer. Today we're going to be drinking Pumpkin from Southern Tier out of Lakewood, New York. Pumpkin comes in at 8.6% alcohol by volume. It's a 98 on rate beer. It's a pretty good beer by all accounts. I'm not a huge fan of pumpkin beers. I gotta be in a specific mood to enjoy a pumpkin beer. And depending on the spices, it's like, eh, sometimes I like it, sometimes I don't. So from what I remember last year's version, this was fairly pumpkin-y, like real pumpkin flavor. And some of the spice, it's not the other way around, like cinnamon, nutmeg, allspice. So it's more pumpkin forward and less spice forward. Correct. Okay. I had it last year too, but I can't remember what it tasted like, honestly. Because the bar where I was working, we had Pumpkin and Warlock on at the same time. And you were drinking Warlock. And I was drinking Warlock. I really like Warlock. We're going to do Warlock in a couple episodes. So, shall we open it? Please. Okay, that thing you were, you're trying to be cute. It's not working. I know, I'm not cute. So, obviously we were pouring this in a sifter today. He actually has a really fun one. It's got a pumpkin face. <laughs> it's got a pumpkin face. definitely a lighter color than I remember. Yeah. This is very golden. Very, like, it actually looks like pumpkin. It's pumpkin colored. That's what I was about to say. It's pumpkin colored. Very orange. Cloudy. You, you can kind of see through it a little bit. I, I can see shadows. Uh, it's very, very cloudy. Yeah. I see some bubbles going up in the center, but... Oh my gosh. This smells like pumpkin. Like, the actual thing it just smells fake. like pumpkin there's a little bit of spices on there you know typical pumpkin spices you know nutmeg cinnamon ginger but very muted i enjoy this a lot i just the aroma i enjoy the aroma a lot more than i remember same agreed it might be because we started drinking at 11 o'clock a.m cheers to that <laughs> you pipe first Kind of like baked pie crust. Yeah, the malt has a little bit of pie crust. I wouldn't, I wouldn't call it pie crust, other than the fact that it's pumpkin. So yeah. you're thinking of, about pumpkin pie. So, yeah, we can call it pie crust. Shall we give it a try? Let's. Cheers. Mmm. 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 Mm. So. Based on the aroma, I'm a little disappointed in the actual beer. Really? I was expecting something different. It is extremely pumpkin-y. The spices do come through, although they are fairly muted. You know what it is? It's the, the beer itself is not as sweet. The aroma just reminds me of pumpkin pie, and so obviously pumpkin pie um, is, is really sweet. It's just, it wasn't what I was expecting, and so I was a little caught off guard by by the flavor versus the aroma just because of what I associate those smells with, yeah. if that makes sense. No, but for me, it's it's still, still an excellent beer, 3.5 for me. Um, the pumpkin really does come through. It smells like you took a pumpkin, you cut it out, and are scooping out the insides for you know doing a jack-o'-lantern. That's what it smells like. As this warms up and as I kind of get used to what this beer is supposed to be, I think I'm going to have to increase my rating to a, a three and a half. Yeah, so my three and a half rating definitely holds up. There are better pumpkin beers that I've had, but this, oh, is, for sure. this is not bad at all. It's an excellent beer, again, Southern Tier. Excellent job. You constantly kick ass at brewing beer. If you've had this beer or enjoyed this beer, let us know what you thought about it in the comments down below. If you have any other thoughts, please feel free to let us know in the comments down below. Literally anything that you can think of that you want to share with us, 
comment down yonder down below please like us and subscribe to us because we are needy and childlike find us on the social media Facebook Instagram I tweet at Clint underscore Archer and I tweet at craft underscore beer underscore Luke so tweet at me I might tweet back Cheers. Here's to another one.